I'm excited news to share with everyone, but especially for the workers in the South. But before we get there, I'm not sure if I shared this before, but my mom used to be a cook in the fast food industry. I remember she used to come home super exhausted of having to deal with like abuse and just like racist remarks from both her bosses and customers. Half the time she didn't feel like she had a way of advocating for herself. And honestly, if jobs that are hardest are paid the most, then fast food retail and service industry jobs would be paying really well. So here's the news. You probably heard of Fight for 15 and you may have heard of their Southern chapter, Raise Up. Well, well, Raise Up is transforming into the union of Southern service workers. They're looking to build on the power that people in the South continue to fight for. It's a common misconception that Southerners do not want to unionize or organize, but the truth is that Southerners, especially black and brown individuals, have been systemically excluded from labor rights, minimum wage protection, and union rights. And again, this has been systemically implemented by racist politicians that date back into Jim Crow era, well into the 1960s. As a result, the South is the region of the United States that has the lowest worker protections, the lowest wages, and the lowest union membership. But even with all of this, Southerners continue to build very strong anti-racist unions, like the Southern Tenant Farmers Unions built by black and and white cotton plantation workers in Arkansas, Mississippi Freedom Labor Unions, and countless other examples. So we're building a union by any means necessary in the way that makes sense for us, the workers. This is super exciting and amazing, and it's not gonna happen overnight, but it can happen with your help. Click on the link here to get involved and get more information. Make sure you send this link to any family member, any neighbor that works in these industries in the South. I had to deal with a lot of abuse in these industries, and I wish a younger version of me would have had the knowledge to know the value of organizing. That may not be something that I can do, but it is something that you and I can continue to do for each other.